Hey, SRF here with mission number 15 from Hitman 2 uh, Silent Assassin game. And this one is... It's just crap. Kind of like this cold I have right now. Just a crappy mission. You have to wait and wait and wait. And everything can be very different. Um, I mean the pathing on the uh, on the guards can change drastically so you have to be very patient with this mission um, that's it let's go all right as you can see I'm waiting I'm waiting for that guard over there to get a good ways past the rock we're in front of and you see how it juts up there he's at the lowest part of the rock and now it's going a little bit higher above his head we have to wait till he's toward the end, end of that and he has to be turned looking the other direction like so otherwise his friggin eagle eyes will spot us and start shooting <coughs> and they do shoot first and ask questions later so stick close to these rocks and turn here at this sort of broken pillar and we're gonna head around towards that opening <coughs> and again excuse me I have a cold so. now this part is the worst you never know where that guard's gonna be he could be off on his patrol where he's going now or he could be standing right around the corner of this rock where he tends to usually be which is where we kind of want him to be and then we basically wait for that other guard right there to do what he's doing now and he's gonna go and take a leak so we're gonna take him out quickly now if the two guards are still standing there when this guy goes to take a leak take out the other guard and drag him back towards where you were where you started but uh, <clears throat> I kind of got lucky this time and the other guard took off so we're just gonna drag this guy slowly around the corner over here and out of view and we're gonna take his clothes And now we're going to wait for the other guard to make his way back. And he actually comes back a little quicker than I thought. So, I'm telling you right now, this part is going to be a lot of trial and error. Um, there's no right way to do it. Um, <coughs> excuse me again, but by the but the bottom line is you have to take both of them out quietly now once you have this uniform you can get relatively close to that guard I just keep my distance because I hate starting over uh, and if you do have to start over I mean you gotta wait that whole time at the beginning again for that guard to walk by so starting over is a Friggin' major pain in the ass. Now I've never actually seen this guard do this, walk out onto the helipad, but for some reason he is. And he actually, in a minute, he takes a leak, which surprised me. And I probably could have taken him out um, as he was taking the leak, but I didn't want to chance it. So we're just gonna wait for him. which I know it sucks but I was gonna speed these portions up for you and uh, or or cut them out but you know what I had to sit through it so you should see what it's like uh, to have to wait you know not everything's gonna be instant especially in this mission so you guys get to suffer too 
Alright, so I thought he's gonna go and stand at his post, but no, I changed my mind. And you gotta watch that particular guard because he does that a lot. Like you could be sneaking up on him and he'll turn around and start walking right towards you. He has no idea you're there and you have to run away still, but it's just a pain in the ass. So here he's gone to take a leak. So I suppose I could have taken him out there and just left him where he is. But uh, I didn't want to have to try and get behind him quick enough. Uh, because they don't they don't take very long to take a leak, so. <coughs> Alright, so I think this time he finally gets to his usual post and stands still for more than five seconds. <coughs> Remember sneak mode, go up behind him and yoink, <laughs> I missed, total miss, how sad is that, there we go. Alright, so I do drag him around, I don't know if I really needed to, I just did it for cleanliness, but uh, oh and if anybody knows an easier uh, way to do this mission, Please direct me to a video or explain it to me because this is the only way I, I know how and still get Silent Assassin. And it does take about 15 friggin' minutes. Alright, so run down here but uh, walk before you get to the right to the bottom. <clears throat> and uh, you can watch as the guard is beating the crap out of some prisoner. Now there's a guard walking towards us, but he doesn't have a weapon, so that's fine. So just sort of walk past them. They get a little suspicious, but nothing major. We're actually following that other guard. So he's stopping right in front of the room that we want to go into. So just sort of hang out for a second and let him take off. Oh, that was quick. Now get into sneak mode. <coughs> before you get to the corner because there is a guard right there and he will follow you into this room if he sees you and you don't want that close the door stay in sneak mode and get your fiber wire ready and you have to stay quiet in here because there is a guy behind that door and if he hears anything he turns around and faces the door Oh, we're lucky. We're nice and quiet. He's not looking, and we take him out. All right, you can grab his gun. Oh, and in this, we're we're gonna get the M60. In case uh, you guys are collectors. <coughs> oh, sorry. You can pick up this anesthetic. We don't really use it, but I grab it anyway because it's there. Now once we get close to the door, get into sneak mode again. <clears throat> and peek through the door. Now this is another part that can be, uh, the timing can be drastically different. Um, this dude in front of us, he doesn't have a gun. And he's obviously extremely tired because he keeps yawning. <coughs> and then there's another guard with a gun. So this guy is supposed to leave, and the guy with the gun right there is supposed to show up, and then he's supposed to leave, and then we can leave. <laughs> Follow me? No? But uh, in this one, the sleepy dude stands around for an extra long time. See the gun guy just left. So now we have to be even more patient, because again, we don't get saves on uh, on the pro mode, so you definitely don't want to definitely don't want to screw up. Let's start over. 
<coughs> so again we're just gonna have to be patient and wait for these guys to go away go away come on go uh, see gun guys even back Now, guy with the gun. Really, we should wait till he walks the other direction, but uh, screw it. If we're quick enough, this will work. Alright, so we want to go in that room on the left. <coughs> and he does take notice, but not much. So now we're going to go get our M60, which is sitting in the rack over there. You don't have to get this, by the way. It's just kind of cool to have in your shed. Big ammo. Alright. So now we're going to wait. There goes... I think that was gun guy, I think. And we're waiting for the other guard. <coughs> and he'll be walking in the same direction. Eventually. dudes over there sleeping. Alright, there he goes. So we can head down here. And as soon as we're out, we want to take a quick, quick left into the little sewer here. And get into sneak mode. And we're going to creep all the way around. <coughs> Stay nice and close to the wall so he can't see you. God, this cold is terrible. I apologize. I just really wanted to get this video up. Alright. <coughs> now, down this hall. Hall. <laughs> down this sewer. And again, patience, because if you. There's a ladder at the end of this. And if you go up it too quick, the uh, there's a guard that'll hear you, and he'll turn around and face your direction for about an hour. So you want to stay quiet. <coughs> All right, so straight up the ladder, and behind these crates. Oh, there's a guard actually two guards in this room. There's one on the other side of this crate, one over in the far side of the room, and this guy. But no worries. You just want to walk up behind this guy and you'll get a little pop-up. It says uh, disable or toggle generator. Now we want to walk quietly, not like I do, and run like an idiot around the outside of the room and then into here and this is pretty much the end so you can wait right here as soon as the lights come on right beside the elevator there'll be a, a toggle for it and here we go call elevator go in and on your left go to the first floor or whatever it is and that's it even though these guys come running in, you don't have to worry about it. You, you should still get Silent Assassin <coughs> if you did everything else correctly. It's going to go up, and you'll have a cutscene where Diana tells you to secure the perimeter. And all you actually do is open the doors, and that's nice it. Work, the Here she is, Blavin. And you open the door, and it's over. So that was a paid in the ass mission, and a terrible cold, but it was Silent Assassin. So, good luck guys.